All right, let's go beat a dungeon. Why do I remember a time crunch after the dungeon? Oh, it's because you have to return the fairies. Yeah, there's a couple of things you have to do once. Uh, oh, this could be really bad. Yeah, there's a couple oh, of things you, you gotta do. Uh, now nah, they're like big dragonfly things. Oh. No, oh, that didn't work. Like they're... Ooh. Those Ooh. look cool. Like they're out of Monster Hunter. Yeah, I know. Come on. Get right over me. Boom. That didn't work. There we go. Yeah, this is like the only time in the game you ever see those things. And there's the dungeon where we're going to get the Mask of Truth, I think? I forget. There's too many dungeons where you have to collect 30 Skultulas. I think that's the one where you get the Mask of Truth. Wait, Skultulas are in this game too? Yeah. But they're not like an overworld thing. They're just like a mini dungeon thing that you have to okay. do for some bonuses. Is the same owl or is this a different owl? Um, you never really get a name. I assume he's the same. Or, you know, like the, the Majora's Mask mirror equivalent. Right. I just always kind of assumed he was the same one. Oh, this is the fast travel song most useful song in the game. <laughs> Steve! <laughs> Maybe your system went to sleep? Oh. I was like, it went black. I have been disconnected from Gentis. Oh no. Oh no. What happened, Steve? Did you lose your progress? No, I'm still playing. You're just not here. But I think just to be safe, I will go ahead and... Oh, never mind. <laughs> what do you mean, oh, never mind? I was about to create a restore point before you got back, but I'll do it when you get back. I don't... Oh, my God. Gentis has come to play. Oh... <sighs> Imagine using the game for something that it wasn't intended to be used for and having issues. Oh, man. I'm sorry. That doesn't bother yeah, me. I'm, <laughs> I'm just, just glad you could come you got back. got the song and you played it and it went black. All of a sudden like... the screen goes, yeah, that's what the song does. <laughs> it bricks your switch. <laughs> I can't wait to see this from your point of view. Yeah, really. I mean, it's almost identical to uh, your point of view, though. A little different from our Mario Kart sessions. Yeah. Or a lot different. Why bubbles? I never understood that. I don't know. Just to be cutesy, I guess. God, you, like, got right in his face. Heck yeah, I did. Look, our first Deku stick. How, are, how is that our first Deku stick? Ah. Uh -huh. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, feels good. Bombs away. Okay, so now that you've got the song and you've done the thing... You could have technically reset back and just come straight back to this area, right? Well, once I get this owl statue, then yes. Okay. That's probably how I used to do it. Yeah. But it's only three in the afternoon, so we're just going to go for the, uh, you know, the real man's way. Wait, were those numbers always there like that? What numbers? 
see how it says four by the sun? Yeah, it's always been there. It dims when you're moving, but yeah, it's always down there. I'm telling you, you don't notice it unless you're, uh, you know. They made it smaller on the other one. They made it like a digital clock, but I like that one. I think it's nice. Yeah. Okay. See if I can remember this song without looking it up. Pretty sure it's... A down. Yep. Got it. Oh, I thought it was down, A down. I thought it, it was, was right, A right. right. But then I was like, I, I seem to remember going A right, A. I loved this as a kid, too. <laughs> yeah, this was cool. The amount of times I did this just to see it. Mm-hmm. Well, that's the cool thing. You can go back and play this whole game again just because you go back in time, which is a really mm -hmm. fun mechanic, you know? If you wanted to encounter the dungeon again, you can. Yep. All right, let's go get us a great fairy and also, you know, a deck of princess. <laughs> Ah, uh, Woodfall Temple. I love it so much. I really like the dungeon designs in this game. I think my least favorite has to be the, um, the Goron one. I don't really like that one at all, but the other ones are pretty fun. See, I just hate the entire Goron bit. I yeah. don't like rolling. I it's don't not like... that much fun. I, I kind of like the race at the end, once it's summer and you get to, like, go racing. That's kind of fun. It can get frustrating when you keep losing it because of, like, bad, you know, gameplay, but... Yeah. Pretty sure there's a fairy in here. Is that a fairy? Nope, that's a rupee. One of these has a fairy in them. And for those of you children watching this at home... You'll know we've gotten all the fairies when the mask stops shimmering when I put it on. I think there's a fairy in here. Yep. Yeah, this is my Donkey Kong Country, Steve. It really is. <laughs> Let's see. I think we're missing one, but maybe not. Nope, we've got them all. Oh, that's per room. Yep. Oh. Yeah, it does it room by room, makes it real easy to scout them. You want to go through the middle here so the Skulltulas don't knock you out. Why did the water level just rise? I don't think it did. I think it was just a weird, like, optical illusion. Oh, okay. Fairy. I think there's 15 in the dungeon, if I remember right. Those things Fun. look like they will eat you. They will if you play as uh, Human Link. They'll eat you and spit oh. you into the poison water. <laughs> well, they're not very nice. They're not very nice. It's okay, they're gonna die soon. Just as soon as we unpollute the swamp. So that's the cool right thing about this game. You travel back in time. Yeah, exactly. But that's the cool thing about this game. You um, you fix the world, like the, the problem in each area, by fin finishing the dungeon and banishing like the monster that's there. And mm -hmm. then you can, what I like to do when I do uh, Majora's Mask at the end, like the final boss fight, is I like to go to each of the four dungeons one last time and just set the world right before I, uh, you know, before I yeah, finish off Majora. Like you do. Yeah. Yeah, I, I enjoy it. And the boss fights are really easy once you've, um, you know, once you've done Adopt. it. S someone, I believe, has done a playthrough where at the end they've done every task, like reuniting k and everything, and it requires, like, tick perfect timing kind of stuff like you have to you have to go in and say like okay i'm gonna go here then i'm gonna warp here then i'm gonna do this but i guess you can technically make the entire world right before you do skull kid at that's the end insane. yeah that's a pretty hardcore level of obsession and if we're quick nope not gonna pull that off Sometimes you can stand where the chest is going to be and spawn yourself inside of it, but I didn't do that good this time. <laughs> well, it didn't help that we had unstable internet there for a minute. Yeah. Although it's been 
decent lately. It hasn't been super stuttery, so I'm thankful for yeah, it. Yeah, I know it's been pretty good. This should be the bow? Nope, just the map. Oh. And there's the stutter. <laughs> Let's see, nothing over there, nothing over here. Already night of the first day, god. Time flies when you're doing a dungeon. Yeah, really. That's weird, I seem to remember getting the bow here. I guess not, must be later. Um, let's see, what happened? That's on the master oh, class yeah. version. Uh, maybe. Oh, we have a key, perfect. Okay, I remember where the fairies are in this room. This is impressive. <laughs> so we gotta kill you. Oh. The original Skyward Sword combat. <laughs> yep. There we go. Okay, there's one under there, but we can't get it until we have the bow and arrow, I think. Or at least we can't get it efficiently until we have the bow and arrow. So we'll come back for that one. But what's really annoying is when you get to, like, dawn of the second day and the screen goes really tiny for a minute. That's, oh, yeah. uh, yeah, that's frustrating. Oh, one of these things, I think, has a fairy in it, actually. And one of them has, like, a enemy. Like a wasp. I think this is the wasp? Nope, that's the fairy. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure there's 15. I don't think there's 30. 30 seems a little excessive. No, 15 seems about right. Are those moths following you? Yeah, and they'll hurt you if you uh, stop moving. Huh. Yeah, if they catch up to you, they hurt you. Put the stick away gotcha. to save it. And battle number two. Come on yeah. down. Those look like Banabras. Yeah, they really do. Uh, I heard the uh, Mission Complete music from Monster Hunter 3 the other day. Mm -hmm. Really got the nostalgia going for me. I remember before Generations Ultimate came out in the U.S., mm -hmm. I had stopped playing it on the 3DS because I knew it was coming to the US. Yeah. And I heard you playing it um, because you had the Japanese version too. Yeah. And I could hear you like pounding away at some uh, at the mine spots. Yeah. And it was triggering like, oh my god, I need to play this game. Jeez. That's funny. Yeah, it is funny how these games, uh, the the sounds just, like, stick with us, you know? Yep. Okay, there's no traps here, right? I don't think there's anything in those pots, but let's just double check. I do he's, like, a ninja. He just, like, Yeah, flip. I know. I love the, the flippy jumps that he does in this one. Okay. Oh, I should have should have rolled. There we go. Got it. Now we get to go fight the shadow monsters. These guys remind me of Mips. Really? Yeah, because they're like pitch black. All these guys first. Yeah, let's see if we can find these things. Um, there's one. 
Oh my god, it's so dark. This isn't just darkness. This is advanced darkness. Oh jeez. There we go. I don't remember if there's a reward for killing all of these guys. So we're gonna do it. Maybe it's that you can actually see the room. There's a reward. It might just be money. It might be a fairy. <laughs> nah, not seeing the room, unfortunately. Fairy? Fairy! That was worth it. Okay, let's see. I know there's fairies in here. At least I think there's fairies in here. Oh yeah, isn't there one on like the wall or something? Hmm. Maybe not. Well, let's check. There are no fairies in here. Alright, well, that's easy enough. By the way, that pause menu, super nostalgic for me. That doo-doo-doo-doo. Really? Oh yeah, I love it. The amount of times you have to go into the pause menu to like switch things out in Ocarina of Time. Ugh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I remember that. The boots. This could be really annoying. <laughs> Get ready for this. Because they are not targeting me. This looks bad. Yep. <laughs> yep, that was bad. I bungled the boogly. Oh, that was all. Oh, that was really bad. <laughs> that was really bad, Steve. That set you back a hot minute. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Better move. Maybe. We Don't might try bring on black. Yeah, really. Smart, actually. We might have to try bubbles or something to get through this. See, unfortunately, the bubbles move in really weird ways. But I do kind of need uh, him gone, I think. There. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, I don't think the other one will be a problem yet. Yeah, you're fine. I say as he gets right here. Well, you wanted him to target you. If only he would get, like, right over me. He's trying. You just He's won't quit moving. trying. Uh-oh. Okay, at least we didn't fall to our death. That wasn't as bad as the last one. No. Ooh, and now he's down here. Now he's on our turf. Oh no! <laughs> Steve, I did it again! 